to a day in our life. This is the show where you get a little bit of everything. This is another episode of the Wonder Bill Show. The Wonder Bill Show. Good afternoon, welcome to today's video. I just stopped by the RV. We still have quite a few things that we need to move back over to the house, or over to the house, not back over. There are many things that we need to move to the house from the RV, so we're gonna be working on that hopefully today. I stopped by to get my dry erase board and command hooks, but the command hooks are nowhere to be seen, so I don't know, I'll find those. I wanna hang some stuff in Eva's room. We've got a bunch of cute decorations that we have not yet hung. And then whiteboards are like my thing. I don't know if anybody else is as much of a list person as I am, but if I don't have it written down, I forget. I have lists everywhere. I have lists on my phone. I write lists down in on pieces of paper. I often lose those lists, but these whiteboards are so great because they are portable. Um, I'm probably going to put this one maybe in the kitchen somewhere where I'm gonna see it often. And my daily power list, my daily to-do list for each day. I try to give myself three to five critical tasks per day to focus on. And when I don't have my whiteboard, when I don't have my lists, it's hard for me to keep those tasks straight. So that's going to be crucial for my productivity. But today I want to hang some stuff in Eva's room. So now I need to find the command hooks and where they went. Okay, I have hung three things. We got our cute little rainbow. And then this sign, we actually had this at her baby shower. And then this one, her sweet little name. So I still need to hang this one. And I was thinking that's gonna go here. And then these, which I don't know if we showed you. Um, agent, my nephew made these for her room. How sweet is that? So he made these because they knew they were gonna go in her room because her room is bright and colorful. And so I was gonna hang those above her colorful little toy bins here. But for those pieces, we actually need like hammer and nail kind of thing. But the other ones are command hooks. Matt hates command hooks. I don't know if anybody else feels this way. I love them. He hates them, I think because I don't know, I think just because they're they're cheap, he likes to hang things with like nails because they're more secure, but whatever. So I just did it anyway. <laughs> okay, this is random, but not really. I just had to share these with you guys. I have been enjoying these ice cream bars, 150 calories per bar, not too shabby. And you want something sweet, they taste really delicious. So these have been kind of my little sweet treat mid-afternoon, especially since it's getting really hot here in Texas and Sometimes you just want some ice cream. No! I'm gonna eat this over the sink because it's falling apart, but it's delicious. All right. It's really what do you need, what do you not need? Or do you just want to take everything over and then just trash stuff over there? Well, we'll, we'll just film this. Just five minutes of eating ice cream. Hold this for me. So we're moving out of the RV. Are we? I mean, we're already out. <laughs> Officially though, we're trying to get everything out. Oh, buzz. I wasn't looking at the buzz, but it's walking away with so it. Much stuff. It's not that much stuff. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's just your thing. I'm afraid to touch anything too, because there's bugs in here. Where? Because we haven't been living in here. You found a, he found a spider. Yeah, point to a bug now though. Oh, I'm sure that I can. All right, go for it. That's not a bug. Liar. Yeah? There's one behind the bed. Oh, is I there? can tell. Is it, is it a bed bug? <laughs> Are you looking for bugs? They're in here. Yeah, you're looking in every single hole. <laughs> There's a sign of a bug right there. Yeah. It's definitely from a bug. It's he not dust. A, he found a spider web. Yeah. Or not just a spider web. A spider had posted up right here. I killed it. It's oh, gone. It's on the little curtain. All right. All right. Ready, set, go. Oh, gosh. 
Oh, well, you know, that's that's you. Well, this ain't Home Alone. <laughs> There's nothing there. <sighs> it's just gonna be like 10 minutes of you freaking out. Hold this. What are you doing? I can actually get something done. You remember all the days we're doing this and the videos? And I realized once we got in there, it's been a year since since we lost Buzz. As of Sunday, July 4th, it's been a year since we had to put him down. And of course I think about him all the time. Matt put up the bed and um, a bunch of memories came flooding back of when we were in the RV with both the boys. And we would put the bed up and they would jump up on the couch. And it just kind of hit me like a freaking wall. It's just crazy that it's been a year. And we both miss him so much. I think he would, he would be having so much fun with Eva. He was always really curious about her when we brought her home. He would like sniff at her head. And Brady kind of was, he was a bit more like, just don't, don't bother me, I won't bother you. He's just kind of laid back, but. Buzz was always trying to like sniff her face and get in her face and like lick her. Um, I think he would really be having fun with her now. Yeah, so that kind of just like, I just did not expect that. Now I'm a mess. It's crazy that it's been a year, you know, last, um, last July 4th, Buzz had had surgery and I think he was a week or two after his surgery, um, he was back to his normal self. You know, we had posted that he was, energetic and he was running around and he was spinning in circles. We went to my parents in Austin on the 4th and Buzz and Brady had been of course staying over there since we were in the RV. The morning of 4th of July Matt's mom called us and said hey y'all need to come over here. Matt's Buzz isn't doing well. Just all of a sudden she said whenever um, he woke up in the morning he was having trouble walking. He couldn't stand like his legs were shaky and so we left Eva with my parents my whole family was coming over. We got there and he had lost control of his bladder. He couldn't stand. So we took him into the vet. Basically the vet said that this was, you know, a possibility that I think blood was pooling where um, the, the cancer, the tumor it was. And they said basically what they could have done is drained it, made him comfortable, but he would have had maybe, maybe a week or two. They didn't know. They said it would probably continue to happen and his quality of life would just be awful. And so, I mean, that morning we didn't expect it and we had to wake up and make that decision. We had to say bye to him. Then we went back to my parents for 4th of July and I was just fighting off tears all day. I haven't cried like this in a while because I think you just kind of start to get numb to to just like the, the waves of grief. And I know it sounds silly because He's a dog, but I mean, he was he was our first baby. If you've been a part of the channel for a long time, we adopted him. I think right after we got married. He's he, you know he's been with us on all our travels, and so anyway, just didn't expect this, but I wanted to share because everybody on the channel. I mean, you knew and loved Buzz too, and I just. You know, I don't want him to be forgotten. All right, so this video took a turn. It started out as moving out of the RV and turned into me crying over Buzz Buzz because I realized it had been one full year without his sweet little face. Yeah, so the RV still has stuff in it. <laughs> we'll, we'll call it, you know, we're memorializing you know, a little bit longer for Buzz Buzz. <laughs> Lord Buzzington, as we called him. So, this isn't quite done, right? And so, I haven't done the outskirts. I wanna do like landscaping and stuff like that, but I, want, I just want it to be done, right? So I don't even have to focus on the house, I can just move on. 
Well, until then, I can't really landscape around where we buried Buzz and create the pretty much memorial like I was going to do. And so I'm still going to do a concrete pad over him, which there are currently just rocks and pallets and stuff like that. So, um, but yeah, uh, that's going to be happening hopefully soon. But yeah, it has been one full year and a day now. Mm -hmm. Pretty much a day. I don't know. I, I've been trying to talk about my emotions. Um, and to share them because it's a way for me to it's kind of like a therapy for me That's why on this channel. I've always been really open and honest and that's why you will see me cry because I don't want to hide those emotions um, For myself because I whenever I bottle them up they get worse and I also want I know that everybody on here Y'all love Buzz too. You know, he was he was part of the YouTube family He was part of our travels like yeah, that one hurt uh, so that, speaking of Letting out emotions, uh, that was the last time I probably emoted. Is that how you phrase it? But yeah, it's been a whole year. And uh, it still feels like, I kind of, there's days where it's like, it feels like he should be here. Like he's around. And we'll have Brady and we'll be walking around or something. And we just expect to see his goofy little face next to Brady's really goofy little face. Bringing up the Bigger beard. face. How he'd always walk behind us. Yes. He always wanted to be at the end. Always stepped on like our hearted. heels. Well, because he, he was um, part Catahoula. Yeah. So he's a herd dog. And so I think yeah. in a way he was kind of like herding us, like making sure everybody was in the in the pack. He always liked to bring up the rear, so. Yeah, making sure we're also going in the right direction, too, so yeah. <laughs> Towards food. Towards food, usually. <laughs> but. Yeah. So it just, you know, I didn't expect this video to turn into what it did. But at the same time, it's been a year. It makes sense. And yeah, he was, I mean, he was a part of a family and it just sucks. I wonder if Brady remember, remembers anything about him. I'm sure he does. He's, he's probably just really bored. Yeah. Yeah. He, and he just has, I mean, I don't know. speaking of Brady, um, <laughs> the goal is to move him in with us. Um, but again, I want the house to be done because right now it's mm -hmm. like we... We never know if there's going to be workers coming in workers and out. Coming. I don't. I would. Yeah, I would hate for somebody to show up. And I mean, and he's, he he can be protective, can, which yeah. is good. But also, we don't want that with <laughs> workers coming in and out. So, um, I mean, they're almost done with the interior, yeah. but they're not. So, yeah. they're, but we won't talk about. That. I don't. Yeah. Want to talk about <laughs> this video took another this turn. Video is about, this video is about Buzz Buzz yeah. and the boys, and so. Well, that's yeah. He's. I mean, he's always, always going to be a part of this channel, a part of my family, and just. Missing. Yeah, but right before that, you know, we had to actually put him down a year ago. It's like we got to see just a little bit of the old Buzz Buzz, and uh, he was running around, and ultimately, I think that's actually what what ended him sooner um he just got a little excited towards the end right after her surgery uh even though there was some space and i think that the vet said it should be okay and he just kind of got a little more away from us than what we expected and we weren't there as my parents but um yeah you know it happens um he was already it was pretty bad the situation was real bad yeah. so well, the he didn't vet even said have that regardless so. he he didn't have but maybe a couple months yeah oh not even that i don't think really it's like he, he said a couple of weeks but i you know we got an extra week or two we got to see him run again mm -hmm. we hadn't seen skinny buzz in like yeah. a year before that yeah he was at least. he was skinny yeah he was skinny again he's like 40 pounds or something so that means it's you know the, the tumor or whatever it was it was like 20 30 yeah. pounds it was massive yeah i think it was 20 pounds <laughs> they said it was the size of a basketball yeah and it was gross yeah. but man he he stayed around for us a little while <laughs> so thankful for that a year without buzz so i don't want to end i mean it's sad but also he was a good dog <laughs> And we have a ton of good memories with him. Yeah. So um, you should end the uh, the video with clips of him. It might do that. <laughs> it's might it might take you a little while to do that. <laughs> I'll end this video with some pictures and videos of of our happy Buzz Buzz. And you know, for those of you that haven't been on the channel for a while, you missed it. <laughs> he was. I mean, you can go back and look at old yeah, videos. Um, one of the memories that I like to think about is when we were in Pagosa Springs going on the hike 
I'm and thinking, of, I'm thinking of the same one. Treasure Falls and want to rehit his little yeah. uh, his part, <laughs> trying to go up the rocks. Yeah. <laughs> he he had some. He's not a hiking dog. <laughs> he had some trouble. Yeah. Brady was, a, and and Buzz tried to follow. No, that was the problem. It was a mess. It was, it was a mess. It was funny. But yeah, I caught that on camera. So I'll put that in here. Yeah, and, try uh, to find that one. Yeah. If if you did, if you have been on the channel for a while and you did see, um, you know, you did get to see Buzz Buzz in his prime, I'd love to hear your memories of him. You know, like what are your favorite videos that he was in or your favorite moments that you saw with him? And um, yeah, because sharing memories is always, is always good. That's it for this video. Here's some happy clips. Thanks for coming to my therapy session. Have fun out there, guys. <laughs> Mm, yeah, I'm still not sure. Still go up to the log. Do you see where the log is? Because then you can follow that all the way up. I'm not sure how this is going to go. I'm going to film you guys, and then I'm just going to hold this tight and pray that I make it across. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> pull him up, pull him up. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Buzz. Oh, no. Buzz, stay on this side. It's tangled under his arm. <laughs> oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Brady. <laughs> no, no, Brady. Brady, go that way. Go. Buzz. Buzz. You, you're you losing Brady. Now I get to do that. <laughs> Alright, we made it up. I left my dignity down there somewhere. Buzz hit his on a rock. <laughs> <laughs>
doing? Okay, let's okay. eat. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs>